Hi everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to find the total surface area of a cuboid really quickly. So let's show you, this is a cuboid. How many surfaces does a cuboid have? It's actually the six surfaces as shown here. So blue is front and back. You cannot see the back part of course. The green color is actually the top and the bottom. So what you notice here is actually they always come in a pair, right? So red is at the side. So here and the other side. In total, there are six surfaces. So when it comes to a question like this, find the total surface area of this cuboid, you'll be given the three numbers or the dimensions. So three times two times one, okay? So I show you the dimension. Let's do the question over here. So for total surface area, you're supposed to find the area of each surface. So let's show you the top part, the green one. It's actually three times two, okay? So teacher already show the, the working over here. Three times two is six centimeters square. The blue color part, let's do the area, three times one okay so already highlighted over here you're gonna get three centimeters square one last part the red color one two times one that's how we get two centimeters square so remember when we do the total surface area right they always come in a pair and make sure you have six surfaces so six plus six plus three plus three plus two plus two and that's how we get 22 so in order to prove to you i'm gonna use a shortcut right and i will get 22 also let's show you how okay so the same question, 3 times 2 times 1 as the dimensions given to you. So you lay out your total surface area formula or the shortcut like this, okay? So you write total surface area equals to 2 bracket plus 2 bracket plus 2 bracket, okay? After that, what we are going to fill inside this bracket, right, is actually the three possible combinations of the dimensions given to you, all right? So let me show you how, okay? So take 3 times 2, put inside. Next combo, 3 times 1, 3 times 1, and you can see that one more combo that I haven't do is actually 2 times 1 or 1 times 2. Okay, it doesn't matter which one you put first. Alright, so make sure the three dimensions are filled up like this. Make sure they are different combinations also, okay? After that, you are going to solve right now. So 2, 3 times 2 here is 6, plus 2, 3 times 1, that is going to be 3, plus, let me write properly, alright. 2, now 1 times 2, that is going to give you 2. Alright, so now, perform your operation, bracket and number, side by side means multiply, right? So 12 plus 6 plus here another 4. Okay, so make sure you know your calculations, 6 plus 4 is 10, plus 12, that is how you get 22 centimeter square. Okay, so this is the shortcut that I want to share with you, it's the same as the question just now, okay? So let's do question 2. Right, now I changed the numbers a little bit, so 4, 3, and 2 as the dimension given to you. So let's start practicing this. Okay, so lay out your working. 2 bracket plus 2 bracket plus 2 bracket. After that, now let's start with the possible combination. So let's do 4 times 3, 4 times 2, and don't forget the last combo, 3 times 2. Okay, once you are done, continue to solve. 2, this is going to be 12, plus 2, this is going to be 8 plus 2, this is going to be 6, okay? Now continue to expand or multiply in, you get 24, here is 16, and here it's going to get you 12. Alright, now combine these two, right? 24 plus 16, that is going to be 40, plus 12, that is going to be 52 unit centimeter square. So it's actually really, really fast if you practice. Okay, now question 3. Find the total surface area of this cuboid, repeat again, so I give you different numbers now, 5, 3, and 1. So lay out like this, 2 bracket, 2 bracket, 2 bracket like that. Alright, let's start. So remember, 5 times 1, mm -hmm, 5 times 3, and lastly, 3 times 1. Make sure they are different combinations all put up. Right, let's off. 2, 5, 2, this is going to be 15. One more time, 2, this is going to be 3. Okay, now here we get 10, here we get 30. Can you see that it's, it's quite simple, okay? Now, combine the numbers now. 10 plus 30, 40 plus 6, 46. So that is the total surface area, okay? I hope you can follow and it's really, really simple. Just keep practicing, okay? So I show you three times already and I hope you learned something from this video. Okay? That's all for this week and I'll see you another time. Bye-bye.